Greetings, this is Daniel Presedo for Photoshop 3D. I was looking through Google Warehouse models today and I came across a window and I thought it might be interesting to show you what you can do with the glass on that window. Sometimes they come out opaque when you, when you bring them in as you can see here, but it's easy to resolve that. So first, let me show you, I can click on the glass here and I'm going to change the opacity. That's the first thing we need to do. We need to bring that opacity down something like 40%, 39%. And immediately you have a nice effect. The other thing I need to show you is that I have a ground plane and I'm not using the automatic ground plane in Photoshop. And the reason I need to do this is to show you colors or stained glass effects from the windows. The colors are not represented on the Photoshop automatic ground plane. So having said that, if I still select the material here, I can change it to say red. This is the diffuse color for glass. Now I ray trace this and you're going to see the glass turn red. And you can do this with any color, green, blue, and it's very easy. The important thing is to remember you have to change the opacity, in other words, for it to actually shine through. And you see some bleeding on the ground here as well. Also, you could load a texture into that and get some interesting effects. I just put some random colors on a texture and you get some really bizarre effects. I think there's some interesting problems going on here, but it's a beautiful effect, almost like stained glass. And that's just an example of what you can do in Photoshop CS6.